Okay, you're the Page of Wands. You have the fire energy. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and or Mars. You're sending messages to the Page of Pentacles. This person has the Earth energy. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and or Mars. The messages are fast and furious. Lots of desire here. Lots of inspiration. There has been loss, sorrow, This person has probably broken your heart a few times. You keep letting this person back in. You keep exchanging energy with this person. Could be a karmic relationship. You haven't learned all the lessons you feel that you need to learn in this connection. There's some purpose you want to fulfill in the context of this connection, this relationship. There is some air energy as well. Maybe you have your Mercury or Mars and Aquarius, Gemini or Libra. Maybe you and this person have a tight Mercury conjunction, trine, opposition, or square. One example would be your Mercury at 16 Gemini trining this person's Mercury at 14 Libra. So... It's easy for you to communicate with this person. It's easy for you to express your desire to this person. The Eight of Swords, I feel like that's you being stuck in the perhaps stagnant energy of this relationship. Doesn't seem like it's really going anywhere. But you have it in your head that this person, the Page of Pentacles, the person with the Earth energy, is your happy ending, your ideal marriage partner. You feel like you can have the Ten of Pentacles with this person. A happy, stable, prosperous marriage. I'm looking for an energetic summation for this connection. And here it is. Six of Swords. So you're going for it. It could be a long-distance relationship, but you're going toward this person. There is travel. There is movement. Inspired action. Maybe there was some stasis some stagnancy in the past, but I feel like the future energy is movement. So, bueno. This is my newest tattoo. My mutable grand cross with Saturn at the top, Saturn at 13 Gemini, Mercury 14 Pisces, Neptune 6 Sagittarius, Moon 6 Virgo. Thank you for watching.